for a disappointing ending to the season? What did you guys talk about in the locker room? Uh, you know, obviously we're all disappointed. It's not the way you want to go out. You don't want to get swept. You don't want to get your bus kicked like we did tonight. Um, but it happened. Uh, you gotta, you gotta move on. Um, doesn't define our year in, in whole. Obviously, we had an awesome regular season, but um, postseason is different, and uh, we didn't get the job done. So, uh, obviously, we came up short. It's never easy to deal with, um, but you know that's when you got your brothers to lean on. I felt tonight that there wasn't a lack of effort, but the execution of the system and what you wanted to do, it was almost like you guys were a, a cat chasing a ball of string that somebody else was controlling. Yeah, that's been our problem this whole series. I mean, we are playing hard enough. Yeah. Um, some of the games we played well enough. I'm not sure we played smart enough all the time. Um, we just didn't play well enough to win. We didn't play well enough to win a series. We didn't play championship basketball. Um, but, you know, we fought. And uh, unfortunately, this time of year, that's not enough. You got to do all the extra things and um, give those guys credit that, you know, they outplayed us. What was the biggest difference in how you guys played from the regular season to the playoffs as a whole? Uh, just, I don't know if there's that much difference. I just think the room for, for error, the margin of error is so much smaller in the postseason. Um, one mistake, you know, can cost you. Uh, one bad minute, I think, was the end of the second there. They went up 10, 12, 15 in, in a minute and 30 seconds. So, um, you know, those lapses, you can't have breakdowns at any stretch. You got to play a complete game. And uh, I just feel like we didn't, in this series at least, we didn't really put together a full 48. What did Coach Casey share with the team after the game? Just to stay positive, you know, obviously to appreciate the year and what we got done, you know, franchise record of wins and everything like that. But also at the same time for, for a lot of us uh, to keep this memory, you know, all summer and, and focus on how much better we have to get. And, and obviously, you know, we, we see how much more we have to do and how hard it is to keep advancing and to, to play for a championship. Fred, how do you balance the, the success of that regular season? It's the best regular season of franchise history with what has to be a disappointment considering what you guys thought you were capable of. Yeah, it's two separate things, and, and it's been like that for me. I mean, after the season was over, we, we kind of flushed it and started a new season. Postseason is a completely different year, so we had a successful regular season, and we failed in the postseason. It's that simple. It's not really that complicated. You don't have to mix the two together um, because we got swept or, or lost in the second round. doesn't take away from our, our regular season, but in the grand scheme of things, we came up short, and uh, we understand that.